Welcome Arisen. Madeline might be the most famous side character in Dragon's Dogma. But her story is missed by many. This is because her quests aren't usually started from herself, but by proxy. You first met her in Pablo's Inn, where she asked you to escort her to the encampment. Afterwards, she asks you for 1k of gold and her introduction is complete. The next step in her story actually comes from Mason. He wants you to trail a suspicious person that wanders Grand Soren at night. The conclusion of this quest leads to Madeline opening her shop. Missing this will end her story and just place her as a peddler in the Union's Inn. After you meet the Duke, you will get a request from her regarding an idol she wants to acquire. If you don't know about the three idols, I made a video about them too. Depending on which idol you get her, she will restock on different items. After you solved the conflict between Mercedes and Julian and received the Worm King's ring, you can go back to her shop and find her missing. Maybe she's off reading or Discord or something. Catling here will tell you that Madeline again ran into trouble and disappeared. So grab her daggers from the counter and start your search for her. You can ask the citizens of Grand Soren about her. This will lead you to the old aqueduct, where you will see her leaving the city. Following her outside to see the conclusion of her story so far and give her 50k gold. Because why not? If you did all that, you will meet her again in post-game, where she will set up shop in Cassidus. Oh, and all the money you gave her? It's a scam. Yeah, your money is gone. But I guess her dress worked on you just fine, right? And as always, stay strong and don't fall for a cute smile.